history that tells such great stories that I like to bring in a lot of people. Um, we've had people come in and talk about the town of Preston and Miles, and we have somebody coming for Sabula, so they kind of understand how the towns they live in came about. And um, by doing all of the Iowa history in the one room school, hopefully they remember a little bit of it and can share some of Iowa's history, you know, with their kids and stuff. years ago I was at graduation for the first time and the speaker went back and highlighted some of the things from kindergarten all the way through and one of the things was the schoolhouse and I thought yes it's sunk in with the kids and ever since then different ones I've seen will say oh that was one of the best things in fourth grade that year you know it just ties everything together for them and it gives them a lasting memory you know, it's hands-on, they live it, breathe it, eat it, literally, you know, so they remember it that much more. So. Yeah. It's bigger, you're right. So what is five? Lexi. Yes, alfalfa. Alfalfa. What is number six then? Very similar to it. Ivan. Clover. Which leaves number seven to be the rye. I see some of us know how to properly clean. Bailey, what is wrong with their hands? You girls are wearing nail polish. You are flaunting yourselves to the boys. That needs to be gone tomorrow when you get back to school. Well, at our school, we have a lot more like electrical stuff. We have computers there. We have smart boards. We have whiteboards, and they didn't have that. We have like desks and chairs that aren't made out of wood. And I did. I was actually kind of before.